Hi everybody, this is Julian from Hugging Face. In a previous video, I showed you how to use AWS Trainium, a custom training accelerator designed by AWS to speed up transformer training. And there was quite a bit of setup to do, particularly installing the so-called Neuron SDK to support the Trainium chip and additional dependencies. To simplify all of this, we've built a new Amazon machine image, AMI, uh, that's uh, freely available on the AWS Marketplace. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to launch a Trainium instance with this new MI and how to start training your uh, transformer immediately without any setup. Okay, let's get to work. Let's launch an instance. Just click here. Give it a name. Find our hugging face. AMI in community MI, uh, no, marketplace MIs, yes. Okay, select, continue. Okay, uh, now we get to pick the instance type. So here we have the smaller one. Um, let's see if we can grab a large one, maybe. Add a key pair. Security group is fine, storage is fine. Yeah, we can go and launch. All right, so in a minute or two, we should have an instance ready for us. So let's just wait for this and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've connected to my instance. Uh, let's clone the repo with my code here. Of course, I'll put all the links in the video description. Let's just go clone this thing. Right. The code is in this directory here. Okay. Uh, so I guess first things first, we can check that we see the neuron devices. Uh, neuron LS is part of the neuron CLI. Yeah, and we see our 16, um, our 16 chips. Each one comes with two cores. So this is the same code I used in uh, in a previous video on Tradium. Uh, I am actually fine tuning uh, here. Yeah, bird base on the Yelp, uh, the full Yelp review data set, which is quite large. Hundreds of thousands of uh, local businesses reviews. And it's a pretty simple example, right? Uh, I've explained it all in the previous video. Again, I'll, I'll put the link. But, uh, you know, long story short, uh, we just need to add this one line of code to our PyTorch training loop to, uh, to support um, Trainium through PyTorch XLA. So very cool. So that's the, the standalone version. And we have a distributed version, which obviously is the one we want to run here because we have 16 ships and 32 cores, right? And this is again, very close to vanilla PyTorch um distributed training again uh, through the uh, the xla interface right here we're just training on yeah 10,000 samples you know, which is fine uh, i just want to highlight the fact that hey we can start this immediately and it's going to work okay uh, we'll we'll run at scale in another video but more on this later okay so let's just fire this up oh no not like that I got to use the port run command. And yes, I do want to disable tokenizer parallelism because I don't want to run tokenization uh, on each uh, chip, right? Would be silly. And here I want to run 32 processes on this node. So I'll just say 32 here. And we should be good to go. No installation whatsoever which is much better than uh, what I had to do last time around on the on the deep learning AMI, you know, which was all of this. No, not complicated, but if you can do away with it, even better, right? So this will start, this is the first run. So, you know, it's initializing all kinds of Python things and uh, that'll take a minute or two. Okay, I'll be right back when we start seeing output. 
All right, so once the model has uh, been compiled, uh, training can start and we can see all the cores are happily busy training the model, okay? So should be done in a couple of seconds. So there you go. This is really the, you know, the simplest way to get started with uh, AWS Trainium. Just grab our Hugging Face uh, Neuron AMI uh, and fire up uh, Trainium instance. Uh, the small one or the large one, and then you can run your code out of the box. No fuss, nothing to install. Okay, I think it's pretty cool. All right, well, that's it for this video. Uh, and of course, I'll put all the information in the description. And until next time, keep rocking.